And Jewel Hillary is live from the University of Chicago Hospital with more. Jewel. Hi, good evening, Eric and Jackie. We're hoping to get more details on exactly how that man is doing tonight, but at last check with fire officials, he was in bad shape. He, along with another co-worker who was not as badly, who was not as badly injured, were brought here to the University of Chicago Medical Center's emergency room. Construction worker Dexter Patterson has a bruised shoulder. The breach I took the lay on side of the right here, you know. But he's grateful to be alive. A whole thing just collapsed. The accident happened around 12:30 Saturday afternoon outside of a home in the 4400 block of South Vincennes. We were trying to build a new porch. This is a picture of the front of the house before the collapse. Dexter says he and his boss, along with a co-worker, were working on the project above the home's front entrance. Dexter says he was reaching to give his co-worker a tool when the existing balcony crumbled to the ground. The porch care came down and collapsed on top of him, and I couldn't get to him in the time because it was, it was on, the stones were too heavy. Neighbor Richard Taylor says he saw the badly injured man before he was rushed to the hospital. He took him off to in the ambulance. Other residents in the neighborhood hope he makes a full recovery. My prayers goes out to that family. Dexter says he did get checked out at the hospital and was released. Dexter also says that his boss, who was working on the project, was not injured. Reporting live from the University of Chicago Medical Center, I'm Jewel Hillary, WGN News.